Hi, my name is Morag. I'm from Our Permaculture Life. And what I'm standing beside here today is Madagascar bean. Madagascar bean is a really fabulous warm season uh, perennial bean. Now, it grows really large beans like this when they're young, but when they mature and they go dry on the vine, you end up with these beautiful spotted beans that are like them, kind of like lima beans. They make excellent stews and you can make veggie patties out of them. It's a fantastic protein that you can actually grow in your own garden. Now the thing I like about the Madagascar beans is it actually grows for seven years, at least seven years. So plant it in a spot where you know that it's going to be able to keep growing and growing. It dies back a little bit in the, in the winter time and then as the summer comes again, off it goes up its trellis. So you need a really good solid trellis that you know is going to last for seven years. I made a bamboo trellis here that I knew was out of quite sturdy um, bamboo. So I think this is going to last just as long enough for the Madagascar bean to keep on going. Now what happens is that I can actually take some extra of these beans and plant them in other parts of the garden so that as this one's starting to get older, new ones are coming on as well. But one really good vine on a really good sturdy trellis and it can be up the side of a shed or over a fence, up over the chicken pen, over a cubby house. You can integrate it in lots of different ways because it, it provides really lovely shade in the summertime. Um, and this will give you an amazing amount of food. You can eat the leaves when they're young, but they're pretty fibrous. So, you know, if there was nothing else, you could eat that, but they are edible. Um, when the, when the peas, when the um, pods, sorry, are really, really young, you can eat those too. But again, they're a bit fibrous. You'd need to cook them well. This is mostly used as a dried bean. Although if you did shell these, um, you'd be able to eat the young beans inside here. They're, they're absolutely edible and you can eat them now. So Madagascar bean, a perennial warm season bean that lasts for ages, a great thing to have in a food forest or in a low maintenance kitchen garden because like I said, it just keeps on growing and it's in a very dry spot here in my garden too. So even though it will thrive with water, um, it will actually still produce lots and lots of um, pods and food for us, for our family um, throughout the summertime. So thanks for watching. It's Morag Gamble, Our Permaculture Life. Mm -hmm.